Rodney Maxwell Davis was born on 7 April 1942 in Macon, Georgia. Shortly after high school graduation, Davis enlisted in the Marine Corps on 31 August 1961, then reported for recruit training with the 1st Recruit Training Battalion Marine Corps Recruit Depot, Paris Island, South Carolina. Upon completion of recruit training in December 1961, he was transferred to the Marine Corps Base Camp Lejeune, North Carolina, and underwent individual combat training with the 2nd Battalion, 1st Infantry Training Regiment, graduating the following February. Davis rose through the ranks and was ordered to the Republic of Vietnam as a sergeant in August 1967, assigned as a platoon guide with Bravo Company, 1st Battalion, 5th Marine Regiment, 1st Marine Division. On 6 September 1967, while operating with his unit in the Quang Nam province on a search and clear mission during Operation Swift, he saved his fellow Marines in selfless act and thus earned the nation's highest military decoration, the Medal of Honor. Presentation of the medal was made posthumously to Davis's widow, Mrs. Judy P. Davis, by Vice President Spiro Agnew in his office. In 2010, several Marines were driving by Macon, including one man who was saved by Davis. They stopped to pay their respects at his gravesite and were angered to find that the wooden monument to Davis was rotting, and the cemetery was covered in weeds and had many headstones falling over. They removed all the weeds around Davis's grave and had many graves around it, and cleaned up a section of the cemetery before leaving. The 1st Battalion, 5th Marines Association was informed and donations arranged. Civilians and other Marines, families, and surviving spouses accumulated over $60,000 and a large granite monument was built at Davis's gravesite. Several times a year, a gathering is organized and the entire cemetery is weeded to, and tended to. Donations continued to be accumulated and are now used mainly for scholarships of deserving children. Davis's citation reads as follows. The President of the United States, in the name of the Congress, takes pride in presenting the Medal of Honor posthumously to Sergeant Rodney M. Davis, United States Marine Corps, for service as set forth in the following citation. For conspicuous gallantry and intrepidity at the risk of his life above and beyond the call of duty while serving as the right guide of the 2nd Platoon, Company B, 1st Battalion, 5th Marines, 1st Marine Division, in action against enemy forces in Quang Nam Province, Republic of Vietnam, on September 6, 1967. Elements of the 2nd Platoon were pinned down by a numerically superior force of attacking North Vietnamese Army regulars. Remnants of the platoon were located in a trench line where Sergeant Davis was directing the fire of his men in an attempt to repel the enemy attack. Disregarding the enemy hand grenades and high volume of small arms and mortar fire, Sergeant Davis moved from man to man shouting words of encouragement to each of them firing and throwing grenades at the unrushing enemy. When an enemy grenade landed in the trench in the midst of his men, Sergeant Davis, realizing the gravity of the situation and in a final valiant act of complete self-sacrifice, instantly threw himself upon the grenade, absorbing with his own body the full and terrific force of the explosion. Through his extraordinary initiative and inspiring valor in the face of almost certain death, Sergeant Davis saved his comrades from injury and possible loss of life, enabled his platoon to hold its vital position, and upheld the highest traditions of the Marine Corps and the United States Naval Service. He gallantly gave his life for his country, signed Richard M. Nixon. As always, stay salty devils, semper fi, and carry on.